Technological Services Agency had warned of the impending flood with the gradual release of excess water from the Lagdo Dam in neighboring Cameroon. The prediction came to pass as farmlands are being washed away in burning Kebi, the Kebi state capital. The flood, which residents of the state capital said was noticed at about 6 p.m. in the evening, turned into heavy flooding the following day. Some youths of the affected area are therefore calling on the federal government to create sustainable drainage to avert further flooding of their farms. We need to assist our government to make a quality bit better quality bit because of the risk of the water. So we need the assistance for government from government. Another affected area is the Fadama Rice Project in the state, which the flood has destroyed and washed away. A member of the Youth Service Corps in the state capital said residents got information of an impending flood, but could have done little to avert the flooding of the farmland. He said federal government should create adequate channels across the country to avert destruction of lives and property. Uh, just a few days ago, earlier this week, we received the news that there will be a flood, that we should be expecting a flood. And uh, so far, if you look behind me, you can see the flood has been increasing over the day since yesterday. Towards the evening yesterday, we noticed that the water was rising. But this is a Fadama area where they do rice plantation. But as you can see, the green area is just very scanty now because of the water. The water has flooded virtually everywhere around and is still extending. We hope that the government will speedily come to the rescue of the people or the residents of this area because the water has not stopped flowing. It has increasingly continued to flood the whole area and we don't know what will happen anytime soon. In 2012, the federal government spent over 17 billion naira to tackle floods and its effects across the country after 360 lives were lost and property destroyed. It is hoped that the present administration will find a lasting solution to the annual flooding and its effects on lives and property.